we started to go trick-or-treating and we didn't get but a couple houses away and she was ready to go back home. She uh, was complaining of um, being tired and leg pain. That was like the first moment that she was not acting like herself. Our pediatrician said, let's do some blood work. And so we did. And the very next morning, our pediatrician called us and said, I'm going to refer you over to uh, Dr. Cram at Brenner. And so he was going to run more blood work. And then later that afternoon, he called me at work. He said, I'm sorry, but your daughter has leukemia. I was thinking this morning about, you know, today's her sixth birthday and how she was, uh, she was born on the Easter Monday. And just the irony of the fact that, you know, born in a season of the promise of Easter and the promise of new beginnings. And here we are six years later, celebrating the promise of new beginnings again. And um, I still remember Dr. Krim looked at us and said, we're going to fix her. She's going to be just fine. It's going to take about two years, but she's going to be just fine. We love every single one of y'all. Y'all have touched us and grown us and made us stronger in so many ways as well. Um, Dr. Cram, I don't even know what to say. You're just, you've been the best. You have walked with us the entire way. We are just so excited to be here. We're so happy to be here. This was a an honor really and a privilege for all of us to be able to get to know the Tucker family. And this is not over, it's a new chapter that will be by your side. Okay. Yeah, whenever you're ready. She's taught us so much about bravery and resilience and how to face our fears and how to be so strong right and i always say you know a lot of us have not met our heroes but i gave birth to mine